This video utilizes Swing Vision. For in-depth analytics about your own game, line calling and much more, click on the link in the description for a 30-day free trial and $20 off an annual subscription. At the start of March 2021, the American Jensen Brooksby was ranked 254 in the world. Fast forward 12 months and he's just claimed his first top 5 win, beating Stefanos Tsitsipas in a result that will ensure he'll break into the world's top 40. For American tennis fans, Brooksby could be the second coming they've been waiting for. With previously heralded next genus Francis TFO and Taylor Fritz being consistently inconsistent on tour, and the likes of Brandon Nakashima and Sebastian Corda could also arguably be described as America's hottest prospects, yet they've not received the same amount as fanfare as the Californian. He's just proving too good to ignore. With the men's tour littered full of stylistically similar players, Brooksby certainly stands out. His coach Joseph Gilbert started working with the now 21-year-old at the age of 7, and the two have worked together to cultivate a brand of tennis that can not only mix it with the best on tour, but can beat them too. 2021 was Brooksby's first year on tour, rising from outside 300 to a year-end ranking of 56. He was propelled into the spotlight at the US Open and when he became the youngest American man to reach the round of 16 since Andy Roddick in 2002, winning over many fans on the way after taking a 6-1 set against the world's best Novak Djokovic. Fellow American Riley Apelka in fact compares his game style to that of Djokovic's. Brooksby is solid from the baseline as he rarely makes mistakes. He hits with relentless depth all whilst defending the court well from just behind the baseline. In so many situations where other players might sink back and absorb pressure, Brooksby chooses to dig in, backing his ability to cover the court. Normally this would come with a compromise, but despite his court position he's able to maintain his quality of shot. Looking at his latest impressive display in more depth than we can see proof of this. In this graphic we've plotted his rally contact points versus Sitsipas and the varying colour highlights the speed of his shot. From this we can see that Brooksby is able to consistently hit the same speed of shot from any position or situation, demonstrating his unrelentingness and his ability to defend. But this match was no anomaly. In 2021, Brooksby ranked inside the world top 6 in return games won on hard courts, proving the quality of his defensive characteristics. His consistency becomes more noticeable when we compare it to Tsitsipas' data, whose greater changes in topspin speed highlight his vulnerability. Brooksby has been quoted as saying, Tennis is not about hitting balls hard, but it's about doing something different, and he certainly does that. Looking at his ground stroke technique, Brooksby has a short take back on both sides, allowing him to take the ball early and on the rise, whilst also being able to disguise his shots well. Altering the data to show contact point height, and we can not only see his consistency, but how he's forced Sitsipas to hit at varying heights, constantly keeping him off balance, waiting for the perfect opportunity to strike but perhaps it's his intangibles that might set him apart from the others, and can see him become a true star of the game. As well as being relentless, he's also fearless. As Lindsay Davenport once said about him, he's such a fighter, he will stay out there and do whatever it takes to win. But his antics on court have also seen him overstep the line on occasion, from taking long bathroom breaks to questionable grunting and even tapping his racket midpoint. He's also got some growing critics too, but the young American is on an upward trajectory and with so much in his game he can still improve, the sky's the limit for Jensen.